Hi, this is Timothy Riley, and this is my video review of the Roy Slate Chicken Roaster. Now this is a barbecue tool that allows you to accomplish a very popular technique, also known as beer can chicken, or in my part of the country, beer butt chicken, where you take a can of beer or some other beverage, insert it inside of the chicken cavity, and that way as you roast the chicken vertically, the liquid inside will keep the chicken moist as it's roasted on the outside. Now, the advantage of using this over a can of beer is, first of all, it has a stable base to it, so it's not going to tip over as much, which I had a problem using the beer can. Also, you can put any kind of liquid in there. It doesn't have to be beer. Uh, you could put wine, you could put orange juice, anything that you think is going to help flavor the chicken as it keeps it moist. Now, the nice thing about this is the handle's removable, so once you put the chicken on there, of course, you don't want to have the handle on there while it's roasting, because the handle will get very hot and you need to have the lid down on your grill. But once it's done, you just insert it wherever you find an opening and take it out. So I'm gonna show you how it works on the grill and we're going to do a chicken for you. Okay, first we start with our chicken roaster and then we need to fill it with beer. Some of the beer, of course, is gonna boil out, but that'll hit the coals and it'll steam up and give it more flavor. Now we're ready for our chicken. Okay, we've got the chicken setting on there. I'm going to now put a little oil on it and put a rub on it. Okay, we've got that done. Now we're going to put the chicken on the grill. I have the two side burners on now, and I turn the burner off that's right under the chicken. I'll turn it on a little bit later, but right now I want some indirect heat, get that beer kind of cooking, and get everything working well. Okay, I just pulled it off the grill and only took about 35 minutes. And doesn't it look great? So I'm going to slice it up and show you what it looks like finished. And here we have the finished dish. This is just a simple little barbecue dish, but the chicken really tastes wonderful. The sauce I made from the drippings that went into the canister, the reservoir, it was a little salty because the chicken had been brined, but it was great. I was able to adjust that a little bit. Just a little bit of corn and potatoes. And here's a really nice dish that was made pretty easy with this device. Now I want to emphasize that I did close the grill right after I put the chicken on there. And I turned the burners on underneath the chicken for about the last 15 minutes. My grill was very hot, about 450, so it cooked pretty quick. And of course it's going to vary depending on your type of grill. I really like this. This is a high quality German product. It's something you can use over and over and over again. I think this will last many, many years. It's not a technique that you might use every day, but it's going to be very popular for barbecuing, especially in the summer. I give it five stars. It does what it says it will do, and it does it well. I hope this review was helpful to you. Thank you very much.